Daniel's potty time. Hi, neighbor, said Daniel Tiger. We're meeting Katarina at the market today. We're going to pick up toppings and make veggie pizza. You should try to go potty before you leave the house, said Mom Tiger. I don't have to go potty, replied Daniel. He just wanted to go meet Katarina. Okay, said Mom, but remember, there's no potty on the trolley. Mom and Daniel buckled up on trolley. They sang, we're going to get some vegetables to make a special lunch. Won't you ride along with me? Then Daniel stopped singing. He started wiggling in his seat. Daniel realized that he needed to go potty, but there was no potty on the trolley. We'll have to stop, turn around, and go back home, said Mom. But Katarina is waiting for us at the market. Daniel was worried. What if she leaves? The most important thing right now is to listen to your body, said Mom. Then she sang, Do you have to go potty? Maybe yes, maybe no. Why don't you sit and try to go? Okay, I will do that, said Daniel. Once they got home, Daniel went to the potty. He wasn't sure if he was done yet, so he sang, Do you have to go potty? Maybe yes, maybe no. Whoa, do, why don't you sit and try to go? Daniel sat and waited some more. Daniel wiped, flushed, and washed his hands. Then he was on his way. Now we can head to the market, said mom. But mom, said Daniel, you didn't go to the potty. Do you have to go potty? Maybe yes, maybe no. Why don't you sit and try to go? Because there's no potty on the trolley. Mom laughed. Daniel was right. She went to the potty too. Then they were ready to go to the market again. When they got to the neighborhood market, Daniel couldn't find Katarina. Maybe she went home, Daniel said sadly. Katarina was at the treehouse. Hi, Katarina, Daniel said. Can you still come over for lunch? Yes, meow, meow, Katarina replied. Veggie pizza is so yummy in my tummy. Once they arrived at Daniel's house, Daniel and Katarina ran into the kitchen to wash their hands. Mom Tiger rolled out the dough and spread the tomato sauce. Daniel sprinkled cheese and broccoli on top. Katarina added her favorite bell peppers. Daniel wanted to keep cooking, but his tummy started to hurt. When your tummy hurts, that might mean you need to go poop, Mom said. Do you have to go potty? Maybe yes. Maybe no, why don't you sit and try to go? Daniel waited on the potty. He did have to poop. Then he wiped, flushed, and washed his hands. He was ready to cook again. The veggie pizza turned out delicious. Next time, before you leave the house, you can try going to the potty too, said Daniel. Ugga mugga. That was more Daniel Tiger 5-Minute Stories.